my. This is a change I didn't expect. Did the King of Puppets get you? Or some other ruffians? I'm glad you're growing. But I'm not sure what to make of this. Be wary of dangerous people. And always be a good boy for me. You don't remember my last meal. <laughs>
Open your eyes! Gaze upon the new world! I'm surprised you defeated Victor. Geppetto's creations are truly marvelous. Ah, but where are my manners? My name is Simon Manus, a leader among alchemists. I've known your father for a long time. We used to be colleagues, you know. Geppetto didn't understand that the petrification disease can strengthen humankind. Locks into conventional thinking, I'm afraid. But even he can't stop such a magnificent discovery. It's the door to a new world. You've seen this place with your own eyes. Truly inspiring, is it not? What do you suppose our cure has created here? To admit some surprise. 
I didn't expect you to be as rational as we are. I'm impressed, even if it's a lie. I'm sorry I underestimated you for being a puppet. You're open-minded enough to hear the truth about the petrification disease. The disease does not signify death. A purified human who overcomes the petrification disease will gain a strengthened body and a mind free of lies. The essence is ergo. Yes, the ergo you use as your power was once a human being. Our undertaking is to help others experience this purification through this elixir. Truly, it's an honor. Ergo's power can do even more. In the hands of the Awakened, its abilities are limitless. We already have the means to control that power. Power beyond your imagination. So while you wallow in a pathetic past, we step forward into humanity's future on the Isle of Alchemists. You're welcome to come to the island and witness our triumph firsthand. Or perhaps you'll make a futile effort to stop us. <sighs> Maybe the Santa statue can help you. In any case, good luck. Standing against evolution must be exhausting. Not to mention demoralizing. Keep your chin up, puppet. And I'll see you soon. No one can say that Simon Manus, leader of the Alchemists, isn't hospitable. Bello, it seems you and I share a strong connection. Ugh. Talking to an alchemist is like talking to a brick wall. That's also an alchemist. Brother, you should say hello to your friend. But it is true that we are in something of a bind. We're going to need to consult with our old friend. You got that right, sister. Our pal is sure to help us. We didn't behave that badly at his last shindig. I hope... A moment, please. My young brother here is slowly but surely losing his very sight, his windows to the world, to a terrible, slow-working illness. That is why I seek the gold coin fruit. It's set to work miracles, and do I ever need one. The alchemists give us just enough to keep him going, but not enough to cure, and never what they promised. We can't rely on those crucible-kissing wizards. Please, don't make me beg. He needs this. Besides, for a fellow who raided the Black Rabbit Brotherhood's den and walked out in one piece, it'll be as easy as eating your weight in bumbaloni. Please, the gold coin fruit is the only thing that helps. Uh, are you there? C can you hear me? Please. The gold coin fruit is the only thing that helps. Can you spare any? As a pay, it happens. It's a smart choice. Those things are priceless. And I don't even know if you have any. But now you know that your friends are desperately in need of it. I don't use that word lightly, desperate. But it's true. Without your help, my brother may never see the light again. So if you do find any gold coin fruit, I hope you'll share it with us. I'd be forever grateful. Please, the gold coin fruit is... Hey, it's... But now I don't use... So if you do... Nightmare. I'm living my own nightmare. Up 
puppets and alchemists forget it. It is their secret island, a place hidden from the world. But even if we could find it, how to get there? <sighs> what about... I don't know if it even works anymore. But one still requires fuel, needs must when the devil drives. There could still be a way, a dangerous but marvelous mode of transportation. But it won't work without a golden ergo. My research, well, Purcinella did a lot of the heavy lifting. 